some of the reports that have looked at dyslexics more broadly have also reported a more disorganized fiber structure to the brain. On the other hand, other reports had suggested that maybe the wires were not so disorganized. We think the reason for that apparent contradiction is that the studies have been looking at different kinds of dyslexic patients. We think that by focusing on one specific type of dyslexia, we have been able to identify a more consistent and reproducible defect. We don't think that that defect causes all of dyslexia in all patients. We think that there are probably other patients with dyslexia that might have different problems, maybe with the way the cells connect to one another or maybe with the way the cells are located. But we do think that this wire organization issue is something which is very important. Uh, and it's very useful to be able to sort uh, different patients uh, into different categories to try to understand then how can we move from that sorting to understand more about the condition.